Hi YouTube friends, it's Tom here. Welcome. Join me because today we're making another paracord bracelet. This one is a design by Cetus. Has quite an attractive front side and also back side, so you can wear this one either way. Start by finding the center of all three pieces of your paracord and have your longest strand here on the top and we're going to form a loop with that long strand so take the left side over both of the other two strands and the right hand side take behind and then cross those two strands over. Next we just want to dangle these two strands in the center. So now we should have the core strands here in the center and these two outer strands should be the long ones. And we just want to lock this one off with a cobra knot. So to do that I'm going to take my left strand over the core strands. I'm going to take this right strand over this one. And I'm going to take this one behind and up through that left loop. Then we can tighten this down and adjust this top loop so it's about one centimeter or half an inch. And once we're happy with that, we can proceed. So you just want to flatten out these four core strands so that they're all alongside each other. And starting here on the right, I want to take them over three strands. And then under two. And then pull it through. and tighten this one up and staying here on the right I then want to take it under one and then around and through itself and then I can tighten that one up too next I want to concentrate on the left hand strand and I'm going to just put these two other strands to the side. So I'm going to go over three, around and under two and up through that gap. And tighten that one down. Then I want to go under one, around and through its own loop. And tighten that one down. Then I can place these two strands to the side and concentrate on these right hand four strands. I'm just going to give myself a little bit more light here. I'm going to take this right hand strand over three, and then under two, and back out through. Then continuing on the right hand side, I'm going to go under one, around, and through its own loop. 
tighten that one up. And I can place these two outer strands to the side and concentrate on the left hand four strands here. And take that very left hand strand over three, under two, and out through that gap. Tighten that one up. Then I'm going to take the very left hand strand under one around and through its own loop. Tighten that one up. Now I'm going to again concentrate on the right over three under two and out through the center here. And then under one and through its own loop. And repeat on the left hand side. Over two, sorry, over three, under two, and then out through the center there. Tighten that one up. And then it's under one around and through its own loop. And then you just need to continue that all the way to the end of the bracelet. Once you get down to the end, we just need to finish this off and my last knot was tied here on the left. So I'm going to move to the right hand side Take that right strand over three and then under two and through. And tighten this one up. And at this stage, we are just going to leave that the way it is. And I'll flip this over and you'll see the strands running through here. We just want to cut and singe these ones. So I'll start here on the left, cut that off, singe it off with a lighter and just make the end nice and flat so it doesn't pull through. And repeat over the other side. that strand off, melt it and then make it nice and flat. Okay, so we can flip this piece back over and now we want to finish it off with a couple of cobra knots. So going to start here on the left, go over the two center strands and with the right strand go over behind and up through that left loop. Tighten that down and then go over the two center strands with the right hand strand and then go over behind and up through the right loop. Tighten that one down and then we can cut and singe the side parts off and 
tie a button here down the bottom. So lastly we just need to tie a button and I'm going to do that by forming a loop coming in underneath these two center strands and then with the left hand strand I'm going to form a loop on top. I'm going to take that one up through the right loop and the left strand I'm going to take down through that left loop. And then to tighten the button we just need to pull directly outwards and then we can just cut and singe these excess pieces. So I've gone ahead and cleaned up the button and that is the finished piece front side and back side. So that's it. I appreciate you supporting the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video.